Hello and welcome to Integrated Clinical Finance with Carla Raj. A 42-year-old Caucasian male, smoker, and his wife come in to see their PCP, primary care physician, for coughing up blood. The patient's wife insists that her husband has contracted lung cancer. She has ascertained such information by watching one of Dr. Oz's shows depicting her husband's exact case. She has been secretly observing her husband cough up blood into napkins during dinner. The clinician confirms with the patient of the wife's suspicion of hemoptysis and further inquires of his condition. The patient has been coughing up blood for the past two months and has been, quote unquote, peeing red urine for the same. Biopsy of the renals reveals segmental necrotizing glomerulosclerosis. Physical examination reveals an erythematous ulcerating rash in the lower extremities. Further test reveals bilateral basal nodules on chest x-ray. A specific laboratory test is performed demonstrating the following pattern. Here is that pattern. What is the most likely diagnosis? Adenocarcinoma of the lung, carcinoid syndrome, eosinophilic granulomatosis with polangitis, good pasture syndrome, and granulomatosis with polangitis, microscopic polangitis, squamous cell cancer of the lung. I tried this format for handwriting type skills. I wish to expand upon this further. I hope that this was a learning lesson and subsequently I will walk you through what will be the correct answer, what will be the differentials, and what type of uh, clinical presentations you can expect for each one of these conditions.